Hello, hello everyone. My name is Bessie and this is Budgets with Bess. If you're a subscriber, welcome back. Love having you here. And if you're not, I hope you are in the next minute or so. Today we were gonna, the, the, let me speak correctly. Uh, what we're doing today is our cash envelopes, cash envelopes and our sinking funds because it was payday and when it is payday, it is save day. And that's what we're gonna do. I get excited when I get paid, obviously, because we're getting paid, but also because, like I said, it's save day. I get to save money. I did this in my last video where I put some change that was left over from my coin pouch, put this aside because we don't need it today. This is the money that we're going to stuff. And we put this to the side. Let's go ahead and do a quick count of how much we're putting in. So we have 100. 150, 200, 250, 300, 350, 370, 390, 410, 430, 450, 470, 490, 510, 530, 550, 560, 570, 580, 590, 600, 610, 620, 630, 640, 650, 660, 670, 675, 680, 685, 690, 695, 700. So 700, 5, 10, 15, 20. 21, 22, 23, 24, 25. So 725 going in today's cash stuffing wallet and also sinking funds. Quite a bit of it is actually gonna go to the birthday challenge because we wanna make sure that we have enough money for my son's birthday at the end of the month. We still, I am two and a half weeks from his birthday or so, and I still have not, I know what I'm gonna do. We're gonna go somewhere to like a jump house or Chuck E. Cheese, pay for like the, like the amount of time that we're in there and just call it a day. Let's get started with our cash wallet first. This is the itty video. Oh, before I forget, there was $2 rollover from my last video, which if you haven't watched, go ahead and check that out. And it's gonna go into a sinking fund. Let's see what we're doing. Okay, so gas today is gonna get just 60 because I actually, I think we only need one more tank of gas because I use my buffer, I use my buffer, that's why, for, for gas already. So we're okay, this is gonna happen. Um, I need to put in maybe another 20 bucks and we're okay. Food is gonna get 120. We are okay with food for a little bit, but I still need some groceries that I need to go get. Spending is going to get its usual 40. And the reason that my envelopes are just so empty is because someone at work needed cash and they just Venmo me the money. And I'm just keeping it in my Venmo because it's like a little saving. So it's like if someone orders um, lunch for the office and I can, I have that $30 sitting in there to Venmo them the money. It doesn't come from my buffer. It doesn't come from a singing fund. It doesn't come from my cash envelopes. I like doing that. And here, we're gonna have one, two, three, four, five, and another five dollars. And giving is for extra tip, or if we see like an unhoused neighbor. Personal is going to restart because we are completely empty with 15, and usually I keep these rolling over. Don't anticipate we anything for personal right now. Web Slingers is my son's envelope, and he's going to get five. And he knows, oh my god, before I forget, actually, let me go get it. I'm Lynn, I do need my change jar because for Easter, we did an egg hunt and Noah's aunt put in some coins and some like dollar bills into different Easter eggs and he found a bunch of them. So he told me he wants it in his envelope. I'm gonna open this up. I'm gonna put these coins in here though. I know this is his own savings, but I always give him extra money for my buffer, so I don't feel bad taking his chain. I'm gonna put that right there. Let's see how much he actually came up with, and that can go in here with his five dollars. So he has one, two, three, four, five, six. So here's five, six, and he has a five dollar here. So that gets him 11 in his little web slingers envelope. It's actually gonna be super excited about that. And that is it for my little itty bitty. She is thick, we love it like this. And yeah, let's get into the cash stuffing of my sinking funds. Here we have the first binder, but I have something else for it as well. 
So Noah, aka Spider-Man, was gifted $20 from my dad. So I'm gonna put that there because I wanna put it in here. He is going to get 30 from me. So here is his envelope. And we're gonna go ahead, we're gonna put this to the side and arrange this money in here. And let's see how much we have for him. So he has 1,000, 2,000, 2,050 in a high yield savings, accruing interest, 600, 700, 800, 900, 920, 940, 960, 980, 990, 500, uh, 1,000, 1,000 is 500 in cash. But that is 1,000, which means he now gets another 1K placeholder. He has 3K saved up. So in the next videos, I'll probably go ahead and take out the money from here to go ahead and deposit into his account. So that 3K can accrue interest. I am just overly just so proud of his binder, of his envelope. I have not had to take out of it, knock on wood. I don't want to, uh, I never want to have to take out of it if I don't absolutely have to, but this is for his future. I don't know what it entails because only he gets to decide what that is, but that is for him later. And the next one is our girl juice box, who is our senior cat. Oh, I'm just so excited for Noah's envelope. I'm actually, let me take a minute to really just enjoy it. I feel like I just zoomed right through that, but I am just so happy to be a mom that can, you know, I know we all want the best for our kids and I'm so fortunate and blessed that I can be able to provide that for him. Um, but yes, juice box gets 20. Does anyone else have um, savings envelope for their pets? Uh, she is getting older, we have a vet visit coming up, so I wanna make sure that we have enough for that. We have 100, 200, 300, 400, 500, 600, 620, 640, 660, 680. So 680 for her saved up. Clothes will get 15 today. We have to stack this back up. And 20, 30, 35 in clothes. We're gonna get through this quickly since I don't have my iPad out. I just did not prepare the way I thought I was gonna prepare for you today and I didn't update it. So health is gonna get 10 and it puts it at 20. Dental will also get 10 and puts it at 20. Disney, we had to use all up, so we are restarting and we're gonna start with 25. This will hopefully be for another trip at some point next year to Disneyland. Prime is gonna get 10. Now Prime has 20, 40, 50, 60. I think that's like, I need 130 for Prime by October, by August. I should double check that. As of state is going to get five. And now San Francisco State has 100, 200, 300, 350, 370, 390, 410, 420, 430, 435, 440. So 440. Apple is going to get 10 today. And now it has 10, 15, 20. Work is also gonna get 10. And now we have 50, 60, 75 in work. And that is for, for anyone that is new, it's for me to be able to pay for my staff to go to like a happy hour or pay for like lunch for everyone one day. So that is what I save that up for. And that is it for my pink binder. Let's get into our purple binder. Here is our purple binder. And so we're gonna start with my envelope today, which is here. That is gonna get 10, which puts it at 20. I usually use my envelope for like, if I purchase a book, if I go over in a certain category, that's what that's for. Luxury is gonna get 10. This is kind of like a very long-term savings. Nothing I'm buying any in the near future. But luxury has 500 in a high yield savings account, which is accruing interest, 600, 650, 660, 670, 680. So $680. 
travel is going to get 50 today. I want to start bulking this up. And we do have our, I know everyone's been, I've been seeing everyone get their taxes done. Let me know if you have not, because up to this point, I have not. And I know it's due. I know it's due. You, I'm filming this before it's due, but I'm pretty sure this video will go up after it's due. We got our appointment for the 17th of April, so we are just going to go ahead and get it done. Travel is 100, 200, 300, 350, 370, 375. So 375 in travel so far. Christmas is going to get 10 right now. Uh, usually after my trip in the summer is when I start bulking it up. But 50, 60, 70. Gifts is also is going to get 20 because Mother's Day is coming up. And I might not have enough in this envelope, but maybe I will. 20, 30, maybe for a gift. and then, Or for Father's Day. Birthdays is going to get 125 today. So 125. And now it has 120, 45. So 145 in birthdays. Car is getting 20. I keep looking over to make sure that I'm putting in the correct denominations. And now car has 100, 125. back to school is getting 10 and now he has 50 70 80 90 95 oh so close to 100 on here all right I'll put that in there emergency funds it's going to get 25 And because of my mistake with paying my card twice, I had to use some like $100 for my emergency fund, which is luckily I have it. I had it in cash to add it, but I don't want to keep dipping out of my emergency funds if I can avoid it. But in emergency funds, we have 200 in high yield savings to 2,050, 70, 90, 95, 100. So 2,100 in emergency funds now. Beauty is going to get 50, and I'm going to get my nails done soon, hopefully at the end of the week, but we have 100, 150, 200, 220 in here. And date night is going to get these $2 right here, and now puts it at 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11 dollars, 11 dollars. This one we built up to about a hundred dollars, and this is all just rollover money and extra cash. When I do a bill exchange, I usually will take out three and put in a five, things like that. And that is it. I have a piece of Happy Meal that I want to share with everyone, so let me do that real quick. So I received this from Janelle Ray Budgets, a fellow YouTuber. Oh, make sure I don't show anything like my address because I always do that. Let me take out what I'm doing. I did talk in my last video about reducing the number of sinking of challenges that I'm want to do. I'm reducing it from like four to just like another extra. I'm going to keep the ones that I have and only replace it once I've completed them. But these I could not, I could not, I couldn't, I couldn't say no, I couldn't say no. And you will see why. Look at these. Look at these. I am obsessed with these. The Sailor Moon scratch off challenges. Oh my goodness, you guys. Look at them. Look at them. Here's your thank you card. Oh, a Spring Wishes Mystery Challenge. I like that. Oh, girl, and I'm going to do two challenges instead of one. And then a little gnome. <gasps> okay, I'm. Oh my goodness. Let me see. I'm going to put these up. Oh, put these up. Who is obsessed with these? Because I am. I've been seeing the really big scratch off challenges, um, like in different shapes. And I think it's so brilliant how they've really just evolved and they are just so cute. And I'm so excited. Again, Janelle Ray Budgets, if you, I hope I'm pronouncing that correctly, but if you are not subscribed to her or following her on her Etsy, do that. Go favorite. I, 
if you cannot buy something right away you should go and definitely heart or like favorite the shop on etsy it really does support them too not as much as obviously buying something but it does still support someone especially if you're not trying to buy anything right away but i'm so excited for these challenges uh, my last video i talked about how i had to use some of them for an extra card payment that i made by mistake which pays more debt off but it left me with nothing in my account and i don't like that it's not like i need my buffer so uh you i lived and i learned and i'm growing but i also am excited to do some new challenges so i'm taking those four and i'm just going to go ahead and start a new one to kind of start fresh but i love these i'm so excited to start them so thank you all so much for sticking with me to the end if you have not hit that like button hit that like button and if you not have you have not left a comment even if it's emoji it means so much to me go ahead and do that right now thank you everyone bye